Jason Chenoweth. that we would be very good friends. No, me too. Because you have this enthusiasm and uh, I do too. <laughs> You're kidding. I know, right? <laughs> We're this, we are very similar and I did make a fool of myself, Drew, do you know? I don't, I would wake a fool of myself every day. What was your <laughs> circumstance? <laughs> okay, so I had won a Tony and on my way up to getting the award, Drew was sitting like where you are, ma'am. And so I'm walking up. <laughs> This is so funny. I'm walking up, I'm like, oh my God, oh my God, And she, you'll never remember this because it was Grey Gardens here when you yes. were up for Grey Gardens. And she's looking around like, surely she's not talking to me. I probably was. I was so like, I can't believe it. And then I got a migraine and had to leave the show, but can you believe that I never got to meet you that night? We all miss <gasps> cues sometimes, but okay, you just got Engaged? Yes. <laughs> he is a country music guitarist and he was at my niece's wedding. He played at an event at OU and she said, I want their band. And I went to that wedding. And of course I was at the kids table by myself because I'm always the single one. And um, he said, I want to court you. And I said, I don't have time, I'm very busy. I've been a run runaway bride twice. I, I don't, I don't, I don't date, good luck. Um, you'll never see me, you know. I did my, all my excuses and he never stopped. And Oh my God, you guys met at a wedding? My niece's wedding. This is out of a movie. I know, write it. This is what everybody goes to a wedding uh, yes. thinking might happen to them. And yes. I love that you were like, no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah. And then I don't he was to. like, yeah. Because I have been to the barbecue rodeo and picnic. And you know, <laughs> I just didn't, I wouldn't say I didn't believe in love anymore. I just didn't feel, oh, I need to get married. That's not something that is going to complete me. But when you do find a person that does match you, it is wonderful. Your fiance is 14 years younger than you. And I sometimes, like if I go on the dating app I'm on and I peruse every once in a while, I will ask people out if they're a certain age. Okay. Am I wrong? Do you think I thought in my wildest dreams a 13 years younger man for me? No, I did not. I was always the young one in my relationship. Why shut yourself off? There are no more rules. Who knows? Love doesn't have an age, Drew. Love does not have an age. Age never matters to me. And yet, I'm kind of an ageist when it comes ageist. to dating. And I was too until now. Okay, now it's Christmas. Yes. You have a Christmas album. Thank you for changing the course of our holidays 2021 and here on out for many years to come. Um, I was wondering if you would do an improv singing game with me. <laughs> I mean, you have it! Yes, I will. Yes, I will. I will, I will, I will. <laughs> oh, this is going to be just, fun. I feel like you and me would like make the best pillow fighters ever. <laughs> like we would just have so much fun, like Coco and socks and pillow fighting and like cozying up to movies and, and like, I, I see a montage in my head. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna give you a Christmas topic and you'll sing about it uh, to a tune of a popular Christmas song. Yeah. Okay, first up, it's fruit cake to the tune of Oh Christmas Tree. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh fruit cake, oh fruit cake, why do you make me feel so bad? Oh, fruit cake, oh, fruit cake, and also, why do you give me gas? <laughs> I never want to hear a Christmas tree again. <laughs> and you're right, fruit cake is weird. I don't like it. This one's good. A regifted scented candle to deck the halls. <laughs> Your scented candles, no matter what the smell is. If it is vanilla, keep it. But if it smells like a <laughs> don't. <laughs> and you know, when it's got 
want that. I was just going to say, and you know that will be on Goop. <gasps> I, I uh, got the candle from Goop, and actually it does smell beautiful. Kristen Chenoweth, I have waited um, to get to know you. I admire you endlessly. You really are a testament to someone who comes on the scene and just changes the world and everybody falls in love with you in so many iterations of all the things you do. Get your holiday spirits on with your copy of Happiness is Christmas and catch Kristen in National Champions in theaters Friday, December 10th. Pillow Fight!